by the president of the united states of america a proclamation whereas on the twenty-second day of september in the year of our lord one thousand eight hundred and sixty-two a proclamation was issued by the president of the united states containing among other things the following to wit that on the first day of january in the year of our lord one thousand eight hundred and sixty three all persons held as slaves within any state or designated part of a state the people whereof shall then be in rebellion against the united states shall be then thenceforward and forever free and the executive government of the united states including the military and naval authority thereof will recognize and maintain the freedom of such persons and will do no act or acts to repress such persons or any of them in any efforts they may make for their actual freedom that the executive will on the first day of january aforesaid by proclamation designate the states and parts of states if any in which the people thereof respectively shall then be in rebellion against the united states and the fact that any state or the people thereof shall on that day be in good faith represented in the congress of the united states by members chosen thereto at elections wherein a majority of the qualified voters of such state shall have participated shall in the absence of strong countervailing testimony be deemed conclusive evidence that such state and the people thereof are not then in rebellion against the united states now therefore i abraham lincoln president of the united states by virtue of the power in me vested as commander-in-chief of the army and navy of the united states in time of actual armed rebellion against the authority and government of the united states and as a fit and necessary war measure for suppressing said rebellion do on this first day of january in the year of our lord one thousand eight hundred and sixty-three and in accordance with my purpose so to do publicly proclaimed for the full period of one hundred days from the day first above mentioned order and designate as the states and parts of states wherein the people thereof respectively are this day in rebellion against the united states the following to wit arkansas texas louisiana except the parishes of st bernard plaquemines jefferson st john st charles st james ascension assumption terrebonne lafourche st marie st martin and orleans including the city of new orleans mississippi alabama florida georgia south carolina north carolina and virginia except the forty-eight counties designated as west virginia and also the counties of berkeley accomac northampton elizabeth city york princess anne and norfolk including the cities of norfolk and portsmouth and which accepted parts are for the present left precisely as if this proclamation were not issued and by virtue of the power and for the purpose aforesaid i do order and declare that all persons held as slaves within said designated states and parts of states are and henceforward shall be free and that the executive government of the united states including the military and naval authorities thereof will recognize and maintain 
the freedom of said persons and i hereby enjoin upon the people so declared to be free to abstain from all violence unless in necessary self-defense and i recommend to them that in all cases when allowed they labor faithfully for reasonable wages and i further declare and make known that such persons of suitable condition will be received into the armed service of the united states to garrison forts positions stations and other places and to man vessels of all sorts in said service and upon this act sincerely believed to be an act of justice warranted by the constitution upon military necessity i invoke the considerate judgment of mankind and the gracious favor of almighty god in witness whereof i have hereunto set my hand and caused the seal of the united states to be affixed done at the city of washington this first day of january in the year of our lord one thousand eight hundred and sixty three and of the independence of the united states of america the eighty seventh if you enjoyed today's video and would like to see more content like this take a shot at the like button subscribe and ring that notification bell to stay up to date on all the latest bird dog content